morning from the Hyatt Regency Hotel in the Orlando airport where Starbucks is just steps away. And today is embarkation day. It is cruise day. One of our favorite days. Excited, Tucker. He like, as soon as he woke out of bed, he's just like, yeah. yeah. he's like clapping. So we have a few things we have to do before we head out mm -hmm. and see the Disney wish. I cannot wait to see the ship. He is so excited. Yeah, I'm excited. Yeah. So what we have to do is um, pack our carry-on bags, also get our bags ready, yeah. put the luggage tags on because they're gonna come up and grab our bags and then we'll see them on the Wish, which is awesome. So, so we cool. don't have to carry our luggage around. So if you're new to our channel, my name is Justin, this is Lacey. We have two boys and we're traveling with Lacey's sister as well. Mm -hmm. And we love Disney, obviously cruises, travel, we do lifestyle vlogs, all that. So. If you want to hang out with us, consider subscribing, like this video. We have a ton of videos to come. We're going to Walt Disney World as well after this. Mm -hmm. We're staying at the Beach Club. So yeah, ring that bell so you know when these videos go live. Other than that, Lacey, let's go ahead and pack our carry-on bag. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we're pretty much packed up. We just gotta close the luggage and put the luggage tags on. So it's nice because Disney gives us two luggage tag stickers each. So the boys have each one suitcase and then I'll put the other one on their backpack so they don't have to like worry about carrying that around. I know as soon as they get there, gonna be like, can you hold this? So I'll be carrying stuff for them. And if you guys wanna know like what are good essentials on what to bring on your carry-on, we have a whole video about that, so we're not gonna go into that today, but we'll link that video below. So another thing I'll be carrying for the boys is their good-to-go drinks. And it's cool because it fit perfectly in my bag. Perfect. So that worked out really well. And good to grow is the sponsor of this video. And we love working with good to grow because they are the best travel companion yes, drinks they are. for our kids. It They're perfect. So Nice. And for myself. Okay. Why? Because they don't spill. Yes, that is true. I wish they made that for your coffee. But it is so nice. Oh man, that would be good. <laughs> I don't have to worry about their clothes. They don't spill. They don't leak. And it's nice because after they have their drink, we can reuse them for water, which is really cool. And Disney trips are so fun because they come in so many different characters that they can choose from. And it's cool because they're always excited to like pick their new character for their next trip. So if you've never heard of Good to Grow, it's a fun, better for you line of children's beverages. They have hundreds of characters from kids' favorite shows like Paw Patrol, a lot of Disney, Marvel, and we have found so many more that the kids love. So a lot of people don't know this, but Good to Grow beverages are made without any added sugar, which is really cool too. You can follow Good to Grow drinks on Instagram and TikTok for new character releases they have fun giveaways and a lot more too their instagram is actually really cool because there's sometimes i'm like oh my gosh they released this character or that yeah. so definitely follow them and you guys are going to love it mm -hmm. thank you good to grow for sponsoring this video mm -hmm. pick up your good to grow you will not be disappointed yeah. the perfect travel companion they really are and i don't see us ever doing traveling without them not it's at just all. it part it just goes hand especially, in hand especially <laughs> especially with the coffee idea i know we'll have to Look yeah. into that. Mm -hmm. Anyway, <laughs> let's go ahead and get our luggage tags on and get going. All right, guys, our bags are ready to go, and we are now finally sitting down to finish our Starbucks. And we have to fill out our health questionnaire. Hiya, pal. <gasps> Okay, we are down in the lobby and we are filling up our water bottles with cucumber and mint infused water or lemon and lime infused water. That's where the boys are going. And also, we have Disney Cruise representatives right here, ready to take us on the ship. Got the ears on. Got the That's ears why on. I got these. They're really. Yes, they're she got good, those good yesterday. Yes. Great pair. So, Lacey is all ready for the Disney Cruise. It looks like I have my little backdrops. Oh yeah, we got some backdrops over there. Welcome aboard. So this is all in the Hyatt Hotel in the lobby. We just came downstairs and now we're checking in, take our transportation to the cruise. So it's cool that they have this all set up. Cast members all ready to help you out. So basically you just tell them which room number you're in and how much luggage you have to make sure it's all matched up correctly. They'll go get the luggage and get on the transportation and head to the wish. So it's super cool, very convenient. So we just got done with our check-in and it was really simple. It was like nice and quiet, like tucked in that room. Um, but they gave us like our group, so ours is Mickey. Which is the first group going out of here. First group going out of here and they told us like what time that we all meet in the lobby and what time the bus leaves. So it's really cool. And then they also told us this part, which we did not realize, is we're already checked in. Yeah, they checked us in. They took our travel documents, yep, passport. passports. Like so we don't have to do that at the number. port. We can yeah. just literally board. They scan Justin's um, magic band. Um, so besides, I'm assuming, obviously, getting the kids magic bands when we get there and like 
lanyard stuff, like our keys, like we're all checked in. Yeah. That's really cool. Oh, it's totally cool. Yeah. We will definitely stay at the Hyatt again. Yeah. It's, well, it's such so seamless. It's so cool because it's like there, you know, there are people that work for Disney coming here too. Yeah, all the cast like, members and wow. I don't know. Yeah. It's just cool how they have the backdrops and stuff yeah. ready to go. So. We are Mickey and they just called Mickey, so we are going to board the transportation. Let's go! And we're off. We're off to see the wizard, the wonderful wizard of us. Yeah, so ready for the cruise. This is the first time we've been like out of the hotel. Well, besides out of the pool. Well, I mean the pool, but like out, like outside of the hotel for like two days. That feels good. Look at the palm trees. They're more ready than you, guys. I know. <laughs> we still need some more coffee, I think. Yeah. Is that all of you? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, our coach awaits. All right, we're on the bus. We got some busy trivia. Okay, we are on our way. It's about 50 to 60 minutes. Bye, hotel. arrived we're about to get off this ship is so big it's so big <laughs> look at this port canaveral it's been so long since we've been here i love it love it all right off the bus and now we are headed through security see you on the other side well we just got through security and then going up the escalators discover uncharted magic Oh, we're back. This is so cool. There's like nobody here. This is crazy. High fives, high fives, high fives. We're back. Check it out, guys. This is what I want to put in, in the house. We got room, right? <laughs> got room, right? The Disney magic. It's so cool that we don't have to do all of our document checks and all that kind of stuff. We're done, so we just get to explore Port Canaveral. This is so cool, though, inside the ship. Oh, I love that. That's amazing. because they have chargers everywhere. They also have USB and USB-C. That's cool that it shows when the staterooms will be available. We're at 11.30 right now. Okay, we're gonna use this time to get everything all set up on the app. Wow, they already got the chat going. Lacey already says hi. It shows our assembly station and that is deck four midship. So it has all of our plans ready to go. We are at Roy Disney tonight. 1923 cruise casual so we always like to kind of go through here and just check out different things and kind of see what's on the agenda for tonight you can actually go and view the menu for dinner tonight as well which is pretty cool you can also view more details for the schedule here and then we can hit the explore tab down there and it'll kind of show what's going on as far as the activities go so we like to go through here and just kind of like heart the activities that we want to do villains game night that sounds fun. Heart that bad boy. So then after you heart everything that you want, you can go to my plans right there. And then it'll show everything that you hearted. It's cool too that they have this thing called ship time. I'm pretty sure this is new. It's nice because when you pass through different time zones that you have an actual ship time. Love that. All right. Our boarding group is up next. You excited? I so excited. All right. We're doing it. Okay. We're going on everybody. We're going on! Hi. Hello. Hey, have my pleasure. Thank you, sir. Appreciate it. Woo! I'm so ready. The sun is it's warm. It's like, I don't know, 75? I don't know. It's perfect weather right now. I feel like the last couple cruises we've gone on, it's it been was raining. Or something, yeah. It's fantastic. We're coming in the wish, everybody. Dude, look at this. It's already elegant. <laughs> Please welcome aboard the Sagman family. Woo! Yeah! We're here! We're here! Oh my goodness. Look at this place. 
Huh? Oh my gosh. Oh look. There's Tiana. Oh look, there's wands. You guys got wands. You got a wishing wand, dude. What's up, dude? That's so cool. Yeah, they're they're actually swords, not wishing wands. <laughs> yeah, give one to Junie when you get back. Got good old Cinderella. Just hanging out. Cinderella. So here are the aft stairs and elevators. I guess we'll go this way. We're gonna do some exploring. We've never been on this ship before, so we have no idea where we're at. <laughs> it's gonna be kind of fun to kind of get the lay of the land a little bit. Look at this, look how they all move and everything. So cool. Okay, so this is like the elevators and stairs. And here's all the elevators here. So we are right here. We're gonna go to the top deck, deck 11. Oh, look at it, Marceline Market, okay. Man, the theming is so cool. Like, everywhere you go, it's just amazing. This is Joyful Sweets in here, which is awesome. And this is Marceline Market over here. Okay, okay. It's just every, everywhere you turn, there's theming. It's so cool. All right, outside, here we go. There's Goofy. Look at this place. Everything just looks so new and fresh. Oh, Funnel Vision. Check this place out. Hey, Goof. Let's go, let's go. Where are we going? Where are we going, Goof? <laughs> that way? That way. Thank you, Goofy. We love you. <laughs> Woo. What was that all about? Goofy, Goofy gave you a little stroll. Absolutely like nobody here right now. It's crazy. We have the whole deck to ourselves. Oh my goodness, look at this place. You guys want some coffee or anything? You guys want some Coke? Sprite? Ginger ale? Look at this. <laughs> Nobody's here. We got the, the lookout over here. Sweet Minnie's ice cream. You want some ice cream? Yes. Well, it's tradition. It's time to get some ice cream. Oh, Lanny got the chocolate swirl. Look at that. So on the wish, they actually serve you your soft serve, which is pretty cool. Yeah. Thank you so much. You yes, much. ladies and gentlemen, we got it. Over here, we got Goofy's Grill. Yes, hey. So cool. The festival of foods, all the sauces, all those dip. So this is like... Lacey's all about I'm the sauces. Pointing one. Yeah. <laughs> it's like my teacher. Yeah. yeah. But this and, is really cool. and we got sauces. Oh, look at that. Everything just smells so good. Smokestack barbecue. Guys, look at this stuff. What is happening right now? Good, how are you doing? Thank you. Man, what are those bad boys? A cornbread? Man, this is like the pool deck food, guys. What? Okay, here we go. Oh, it's just so good. It's so good. And we got Daisy's Pizza. This is the Donald's Cantina. Has like all the salsa. I can't believe this is like the, the pool deck food. Oh my goodness. All the tacos. Okay, we're gonna go to Marceline's Market because mommy is hungry. Uh, and get some food and then we're gonna head out and maybe check out the kids area. Pretty cool. I'm excited to see what the options are. Got the flowers up here. Hello. Welcome to Thank you. Even the hand washing area is just super nice. And check this out, they have a tuck size. They have a kids sink. That's really cool, I love that. My parents and my parents get a table first, put their belongs. Have a look on the lines, they enjoy, have amazing lines, okay? okay. Thank, yeah, thank you. you so much. I only want to eat the good stuff. I love that. So the cast member said, little tip, get a seat first. So we're gonna bypass all the food, even though it smells amazing. Grab a place to sit, 
then we're gonna go and get the stuff. This is really cool because it's like a kids counter right here. I love that. Look at all this stuff. They got fries, chicken tendies, mac and cheese, all the stuff the kid wants. Well, we got our table. Now we're gonna get some food. Lannon and Tucker are at the kids counter getting their place and getting ready to eat. You want chicken tenders? Yeah. Tuck's getting some chicken strips, fries, mac and cheese. Can I have some of your chicken strips? <laughs> so I think we're gonna start out with some crab legs and shrimp and all the good stuff. They got Thank you. the shrimp, the Thank crab you. legs, they got the cocktail Thank sauce, the Thank lemon. You. Check it out. Okay. So another little tip and trick, once you find your table, you just start dumping food off. You're gonna dump this off, and we're gonna get some more. So this place is called the Market Deli. We got grilled chicken salad, which looks really good. A chef salad, house salad. We also got all the rolls, all the soups. This is the signature choice. They have pot stickers, guys. Look at all the stuff they have, guys. Chicken tikka masala. Ah, thank you so much. Look at that. Yes, please. So I'm really liking all the food options. There's a lot, a lot more food options on the Wish, for sure. And then we have the chef's counter. Oh my gosh, what is this? Look at all that, all the, all the breads. This is one of the items that we wanted to try. Appreciate it. Yes, look at that. This is the pasta special right here. I think I might try the pasta with spinach pesto. Okay, I think I'm at the point where I should probably just sit down and eat my food rather than just keep on getting up and getting more. I think I have plenty, so let's eat. So I was had to get a drink and then I saw this area here, the pantry favorites, apple crumble that looks fantastic. We got raisin and oatmeal cookies, also chocolate chip cookies, and they have a celebration cupcake. Wait, what? Sorted jello cubes, carrot cake, Oh my gosh, Oreo cookie cheesecake. I just passed by the salad. I'm like, maybe I should get a salad. I'm like, you know what? No. <laughs> I'm gonna sit down and see what I got and then go back if if I want. But also the dessert area looks amazing. Okay guys, let's look at this table. This is this is ridiculous. <laughs> Well, we all got like the whole plate of the shrimp and crab, yep. and then the charcuterie board. It's not like, it looks a lot, but it's not a lot, you know what I mean? It's yeah, not like heavy. A lot of plates, right? A lot of plates. I saw that, I saw the orso. I know, I can't, yeah, I cannot wait for this right here. Yeah. Um, their food options are fantastic. So good, so good. Right? laid out so well. I, I like it. It's really nice they serve you, honestly. It's nice, but also yeah. what I like about it is that there's different stations, because there's some things I just want to bypass. Right. Yeah, exactly. And then not have to like wait in line for, you know what I mean? So. Super good. I love how I love how like Tucker just like took that apple and just went all the way around. That's Landon. Oh, that's Landon. Landon yeah, yeah. <laughs> Landon. He just like, woo! I'm done. <laughs> Cruise life. Oh Tucker man. Tucker got some tomato soup too. How's the tomato soup, bud? Yeah. Is it super good? Kids counter. And then he disappears, and I'm like, where are they gonna go? And me and Tucker turn around. Tucker's like, he's over there. He's at like a round table eating all by himself. <laughs> I was like, is that our so table? We're, we're, we're talking about Landon. He's just loving his freedom right now. He's just eating at his, the table by himself. It away. I'm like, Landon, we're over, we're here. over here, bud. <laughs> okay, guys, this orzo spinach pasta is so good. It's so good. And the cast member, her name was Gloria. I saw her talking to yeah, you. She was really she's sweet. from the Philippines. Oh. She was so nice. Anyway, so um, shout out to Gloria. You're awesome. I mean, this is amazing. Well, everybody, we had shrimp, we had pot stickers, we had... It wouldn't be, it wouldn't be complete, Hold on, let, let, let's vlog this. Wouldn't be complete. They're honey and mustard. I just wish I could bottle it up and take it home. It is the best. I mean, why not? Just do it. And we got to end this with celebration cake. Celebration cupcake. Bon appetit. So good. Right? We have all of it. This is actually really good. Well, we are out and about, headed to the kids area. I really want to go down the slide. That's that's where we're at. Excited for the slide? Mm -hmm. Full slides. Check it out, it's Gus Gus. Okay, we are on deck three, coming back to the Grand Hall. Now we're headed to the kids club. This area is so awesome, and check it out, there's the slide. There's the slide to go down to the kids area, all right? Goodbye, Landon. 
<laughs> Goodbye, Tuck. <laughs> okay. I had to take all the camera gear off. Now it's my turn. All right, here we go. Oh my gosh. <laughs> that is so fast. Okay. <laughs> the boys are stoked. Okay, okay. Tucker's gonna show me something. What? Oh my gosh. Dude, what? Look at this place. Look at this place. This is so cool, Duck. What is that? Oh, what is that? Can't even tell. Wow, this place is really cool. This place makes me really excited for Galaxy's Edge. Oh my gosh. We got C3PO up here just hanging out. Love it. Why is it so fun to push buttons and switches? I don't know. But it's they, just something about it. Something you, know, about you know what I mean? It's just like I love how they actually enticing. make it so you can do Yeah, it. it's really fun. Oh, it's so satisfying. <laughs> well, we are leaving Star Wars Cargo Bay. Head of the next room. Oh my goodness, this wallpaper is just fantastic. Man, I would love to have this in our studio. That is so cool. Okay, we are headed into Marvel Superhero Academy. Bum ba bum. What? Spider Man's here? Are you serious? Dude, Spider Man's here. Yeah. Landon's like, he talked to me. <laughs> so this suit you can actually design, and they have, they have the different missions and everything with your suit on, isn't that cool? So after they make their suit, they have this like, special like missions training area, which is really cool. So the kids are going to love this when they get back in the kids club. Okay, the boys are gonna pick their suit out so they're ready for the training. Skiing a band, boom. There you go, access granted. That's your first mission. New, New York, York City. City. <laughs> Whoa. Spider Man. You gonna do Spider Man? Whoa. Oh. That's so cool, dude. All right, it's Tuck's turn. Here we go. Boom. <laughs> All right, leaving the Marvel Academy. Let's see what else is in here. All the bathrooms. I love the theming of the doors. Entering the fairy tale hall. Wow, it's just so cool. <laughs> These spaces. <laughs> Look at this. Man, you can play some card games right here. Just hang out. What? We need it. We need to have this table for card games at home. It's like perfect. Love that. Ship right here. I love how it has all the time zones Anaheim, Orlando, Paris, of all the different parks. It's super cool. Check this place out. It's so cool. Okay, well, the boys are creating their perfect roller coaster, and Tuck is patiently waiting for what Landon picks out. Whoa! This is a perfect place for little Junies. <laughs> so glad they have spaces like this for toddlers. 
And this is the small world nursery right here. That's cool. Ginny would love this. Look at all this. All the theming super cool. Oh, there's all the cribs. Oh, that's so cool. The mobile. What a great nursery. So the captain's quarter, I forget what this area is called that we're in, um, I was just told that there's doors like to the nursery right there and they'll close those so then this is open to the whole kids club. But then she said sometimes they'll close this area to the kids club so then the nursery can use it. So that was cool. And then she said sometimes they actually close both doors and then you can only enter in through the main door to do they have like a toddler time. Oh, so cool. That's okay. Really cool. Nice. Yeah. But the boys are like really liking it in here. So they said most of the time it's uh, for the kids' club. So that's fun. awesome. I love how they designed it so that way yeah. it can be used for multiple multiple that's things. That's a really good idea. Yeah. Yeah. Because that's what they're missing for like toddler time and yeah, stuff. They and didn't... The other ships. Yeah, it's yeah. perfect. Well, I have to say the kids' spaces are on point and the boys cannot wait to come back and explore more, which is exciting because on the other ships, the boys are kind of already over it during the open house. <laughs> so if you guys didn't know, um, right now it's called an open house. And that means anyone can come in, check out the spaces, and they have open houses during the time of your cruise. The first day to us looks like exploring everything, getting the lay of the land, seeing the spaces that we can't see, only in open house times. The boys are definitely ready to go back, which is very encouraging. Especially the Star Wars area and the Marvel area, they're gonna have the time of their life. The fact that Spider-Man was just in there, hanging out during an open house, was fantastic. Anyway, very impressed. Well, we're leaving the kids club for now. I love the wallpaper, my goodness, it's so cool. This is cool, it kind of shows all the upcoming activities and events for the kids club. That's awesome. Youth activities up in house, Disney Junior Dance Party, Heck yes. Check it out, it's Belle. Hi, Belle. Oh, Tucker, she blew you a kiss, kiss dude. She blew you a kiss. <laughs> no, that was you, Tug. That was all you, dude. It's your blue eyes, dude. <laughs> okay, it is about 1.25. Our room should be ready about 1.30, so hopefully by the time we get up there, it's gonna be ready to go. Wow, we got the food, we checked out the kids club, we got to get the lay of the land a little bit, and now let's go to our room, unpack, chill out for a minute, let things process. <laughs> and Lacey actually has a massage coming up. What time? Lacey has a massage in 30 minutes, so she's gonna be relaxing for sure. Well, as you can see by the holding tank, <laughs> They haven't opened the rooms yet, but it should open in about three minutes. Okay, Disney, right on time. It is 1.30, and they're opening up the rooms. Let's go. I love these hallways. I love the wood, and then the, the green on the, on the walls. Super cool, and the light fixtures up top. Look at that. Okay, guys, here we are, 10, 5, 4, 8. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try this. And the first time in forever. Nope. Try Landon's card. Landon's card works. Nice. All right. Whoa. What? Oh. Okay, guys, we'll do a room tour in just a bit. Wait, how did you get your luggage it was already? already? Ready. What? Steven brought it over for me. Good job, Steven. <laughs> so, Justin, I think, is doing just like a whole room tour. And then I think Cassie's gonna take the boys to the pool because they are dying to go, to go to the pool. And I actually have a massage booked today for my birthday because it's gonna be my birthday on this trip. So I'm so excited. So I'm trying to find where the spot is. Found it. There was a whole team that greeted me, but this is really nice. Okay, so here's the locker room. They've got like lockers, a little spa over there, showers, just the sinks. It's really nice. So I think I go over to this waiting room now. Okay, so as you guys know, Lacey is on her way to her massage. So we have the Family Deluxe Veranda, and we are 10548. Well, let's do this thing. All right, so you gotta put your key card in there, activate the lights. Okay, so first off, when we first came in here, we're like, my goodness, it's just, it's bright. It's airy, I don't know, it's just, I guess it's just clean. I don't know, it's just the best way I can explain this. So on the left-hand side is your vanity and also your shower and bath. And then on this side is gonna be 
closet space. So let's start right here. We open this up and the first thing that happens is the lights go on. And there's a lot of hangers, which is great. Nice robe, just lots of room. And then we'll open the middle section now. We have all these shelves, which is great. We have a safe, we have our laundry bag right here, and then more shelves. And they're deep too, like they're deep shelves. That's my whole arm right there. And then we'll open the last one. And then we have a bunch more room to hang things. Um, you can even put like a hamper basket in here. I love this area too, this little corner area. Cause there's just, again, more shelves. And I feel like you can never have enough shelves in your stateroom. And as you can see, I already occupied the top one, but that is great there. Now let's go ahead and check out the toilet. So right here is the bathtub and the shower. Over here is your toilet. Boom. First off, I love the light underneath the vanity. I think it is so cool. Um, I love how this is all positioned and I love the light around the, the vanity. We got some more shelves over here and just plenty of room, plenty of room to do your business. <laughs> uh, I got all these little hooks up here to kind of hang, I don't know, whatever you wanna hang. And then we'll come over here to the shower. This is really cool because we have a full length mirror right on the door. It just makes this place look so much bigger for some reason when we open this door. Anyway, we have a bathtub, which I love that about Disney Cruise Line, that it has a bathtub. We have that, shower, and again, I love how just bright it is in here. It's just. So nice, have this little light right up top here. I'm gonna go ahead and get in the shower. You can kind of pull this little guy right here, this little string, and it attaches right here. So we can hang all of our wet swimming suits and all that stuff right on here. We have, again, more shelves. Shampoo, conditioner, and body wash. So I am five foot 10 and I just extended the shower head all the way up. And it's, it's perfect. So I feel like there's just a good amount of room, but even if you're taller than that, it's nice that you can just take this off and have a little personal shower there. And then we have our vanity. I love how there's Kleenexes right there. And then there's a trash can over here and then where your towels go there. But then you have good counter space, some more shelves up here, have a little makeup towel, which is nice. Some more hand towels. And again, I just love how there's lights around the vanity mirror. Check it out. There's more hooks right here too. Gotta love hooks. That is the shower and bath. And then you walk into the main cabin. First thing you're gonna see is you're greeted with your name. In this case, welcome aboard Zachman and Carlton party. When you come in, the, the music is going. And also one thing to note too is when you come in, they have the thermostat all the way down to cool. So it just felt really, especially this day, cause it's kind of warmer, it just felt good walking in, a nice little breeze. But our theme for our room is Moana. Without further ado, here is our bed. The boys already jumped on it a couple times. I love the Wish blanket. I mean, I wish they sold these. Maybe they do, I don't know. Check out the gift shop later. But you gotta love the headboard, the art, the theming. Turn on the lamp, look at that. There's also a reading light, dims as well, which that's really cool. And you can move this around wherever you want. These light switches actually activate the ceiling right here, as you can see. So in this case, we will need a travel adapter to use this plug, which I brought one. That's a tip we have. We'll link all of our Disney Cruise tips and tricks below. What's cool about it though, is they have two USB outputs. And then we have a drawer. What I usually keep in here is actually uh, our tip money. So whenever we do room service, I give them tips. And I know you can do this on the app as well, but I like to give them cash tips. So I keep all of our cash tips in there. So it's ready to go for my room service. <laughs> and then right over here on the other side of the bed, there's going to be same thing with the lamp, the reading light, all that stuff, light switches. You have outlets here and then you have USB and also USB-C, which is awesome because as you know, everything is going to that. So it's great they put that in the ship. And then we have another drawer that is empty. We have this curtain right here that we can drape across this area. So we have some privacy from this area to the other living quarters. Gotta love all the art. Um, but this right here comes down. I'm actually gonna put some B-roll for you guys now so you can see when it's all open. This acts as a bed as well. So we have a bed for the boys, but during the day we have a nice couch. And I love this feature right here because it's a little coffee table, but it's just, it's smaller. You can put it anywhere. Um, it's just, I like how it's not so big. Like yeah, some of the other ships are, it's just, it's just a big oval kind of thing. So I love how this is just kind of easy to put wherever. And then over here is actually a Murphy bed because we have the deluxe family. Cassidy is going to stay here. And again, I'll have B-roll over this. so You can see what it looks like when it's put down in the evening. But what's really cool is during the day, you have all this room over here to put like, you know, backpacks or whatever, um, shoes. I don't know what we're gonna put here yet. We're gonna probably put a lot of our stuff under the bed. 
which I'll talk about that in just a bit, but it's just nice having this big open area to store different things. And speaking of the bed, we have so much room to be able to put all of our luggage underneath there. So once we get all of our luggage, we'll unpack and get it all ready to go. And now we have this vanity with a lot of shelves. We have a lot of drawers, really nice, big space. So first we have our phone for calling room service. We got some more Kleenexes, just some more shelves to put different things. I love this area because it's a custom fit trash can. I love that. <laughs> I, love, I love how it's all custom fit. And then we have a nice little vanity seat right here, little ottoman, little stool, whatever you want to use it for. And again, I love that the vanity mirror lights up. And they have all these lights. You have the balcony, curtain, ceiling, and mirror. So we have our mirror we can shut off here. And then we have our ceiling controls this guy. Then we have our curtain, which controls right over here. And then our balcony. Now before we go into all the drawers, let's show you the castaway key swag. So Lacey and I are gold this time. This is our first cruise gold we were very excited and i just love the updated lanyards captain mickey that's super cool i love how that like uh almost like a tiffany blue uh looks with the yellow i don't know awesome lanyard and then the boys and cassie they are not quite gold yet they're silver so that's what the silver one looks like as well and then we got a wet dry bag guys <laughs> Lacey was so excited about this uh it says castaway key club on there but I love there's Minnie, um, Mickey over here, Disney Cruise Line over there. Such a cool bag. And then we got this tote bag, and this is awesome. I love how it's kind of like water resistant, it feels like. Castaway Club, Disney Cruise Line. It's time to cruise. Yes, it is. Thank you for that. It has a zipper up top here. Oh, look, it even has the, the DCL logo. I love that. And then inside here, it says Castaway key club and there's a little pocket for some organization and all that stuff and then right over here we actually got a gift from one of you guys the Zachman fam sorry we missed you have fun Jay and Stacy Overbeck so they actually just got off of a cruise right before us so Bon Voyage Suites thank you Jay and Stacy that meant so much to us coming in here the boys were like super excited uh, but thank you for thinking of us we really appreciate you guys I also ordered some Dasani waters you can do this on the app before you cruise and we have some more shelves Lacey already put her ears we got her good to grows all ready to go and then for the drawers so let's start right over here make sure you always check this drawer because inside here you're gonna have this this is what you want okay um this is for the morning if you want to have like a little continental breakfast delivered to your door you put this out you can put the time you want um you have your juices your breads and pastries your condiments your beverages all that kind of stuff and put this out the night before it says put on the doorknob before 3 a.m and then in the morning, you can select which time you can have your breakfast. Uh, you have a nice Disney Cruise Line pen in here. These are all freebies. I got some envelopes and we have some postcards. If you're going to Castaway Key, you can actually put it in the mailbox and send it home, which is fantastic. But again, these are all freebies. Take them. Got some paper for some notes or whatever. Come over here to this drawer. We got a hair dryer in here. And then over here, again, we got some more shelves and they're very, very deep. And then right here, just another big deep drawer. And then this is my favorite because this right here is the beverage fridge. We already got some water in there getting nice and cold. Oh yeah, they actually already got pretty cold. It's only been in here for like 20, 30 minutes. And if you're sailing with six or more people, you can get a conjoining room if you want to as well. That's where you'll open up to the other room. We've actually had that before, but we didn't vlog that trip. It was before we started vlogging. So sorry, we don't have the footage but it was really cool. And now the moment we've been waiting for, the veranda. So here we go. And this is our veranda. Look at the view that we got, Port Canaveral. Super cool. Wow, amazing. I love to be able to see like the track right there. On deck 10, you have this right over you, um, but it doesn't block your view. So this is my POV right here. You don't even see it. Nice and shaded in here, which is great too because of that. Well, we have two chairs out here. Boom and boom. A nice little end table. So this is going to be perfect. Cannot wait. Well, guys, there's our stateroom, our home for the next three days. I think I heard our luggage, maybe. So if our luggage is here, I'm going to start kind of unpacking a little bit and then at least get my swimming suit on and then head downstairs to meet up with the boys. But while I'm doing that, enjoy this time lapse of Port Canaveral. Well, 
luggage is all put in. Haven't put everything away yet, but it's all here and I was able to get my swimming attire on. So I'm gonna go to the pool, hang out with the boys. And then when Lacey's finished with her massage, I'll come back in here and get everything all straightened up for our next few days. The great thing is, is we are deck 10 for our room and uh, the pools and everything is deck 11. It's kind of why we did that because we knew we were going to be on deck 11 quite a bit. So it's nice that we don't have to wait for the elevators. We can just go right up. And also our room is really close to the staircases and elevators as well. So it's a good, it's a good number. Okay, I found them. Hello. How's the pool life? So sweet. I had yeah? two ice creams and I got two ice creams and an apple. Two ice creams and an apple? I just like did not want to get out the whole entire time. Really? Yeah. That's awesome. So we got Daisy's pool right here. We got Donald's pool right there. That's where the boys are hanging out. We got the Aqua Mouse, which we'll have to do that at some point right up there. And then we got Pluto's pool and Goofy's pool. So boom, 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 boom. Aqua Mouse, okay. And then we got this pool over here next to the Funnel Vision. It's kind of like uh, stadium seating to watch the Funnel Vision where all the pools are at. It's kind of cool. They are starting to close down all the pools, most likely getting ready for the mustard drill. So we're gonna head back to our room, unpack. That way we're all ready for the next three days and we get it done before the mustard drill. Okay, my massage was awesome. I felt so relaxed. I uh, just contacted Justin there at the room, so I'm gonna head back there, but that was so fun. I was actually thinking of canceling it because by the time we booked it, it was like not very many slots left except for the first day today. And I was like, I don't really wanna do it like when we first get on the ship, you know, but I was like, I'll just keep it. But highly recommend it because I just feel, ooh, there's, the Arendelle restaurant there, uh, that you just feel like relaxed already and just unwind and the ship hasn't even left yet. It's kind of cool. So I may remember that for next time again. You gotta love packing cubes. So I have my shirts back here, socks, boxers, got my pants, other sh graphic shirts, and then I have my swimsuit stuff. Over here, I got my workout stuff, my beanies and hats, and then I'll hang a couple like, you know, collar shirts. But love packing cubes because they organize your stuff in here, but also it's nice when you get to unpack because leave everything in the little compartments all organized. So when you have to like repack, especially if you're going to another place like we are, it's just nice that it's all organized. We will link these hooks below from Amazon, but they are fantastic because boom, we just put them here and then we can put our hats and all that kind of stuff right there. Just some more room. And the boys are having a time of their life right now. <laughs> just on the veranda. Love it. Well, everybody, Lacey's back, as you probably know. But while Lacey is unpacking, we're going to put our magnets on our stateroom door. Oh, Look at that. Good. fits perfect. So there's that. Wait, Zach and family. Can I, can I do mine? All right, we'll show you can when I we're do done. Pluto? Boom. There it is. We got all of our magnets. So we got the Zach and family. We'll link all this below where we got this from awesome Etsy shops, Justin, Lacey, Cassie, Lennon, Tucker, and then we have Cruising with Mickey. Caution, Mickey bars being eaten. Cruising with Mickey, and caution, tally animals on the loose. Yeah. Boom. We did it, guys. It looks great. Teamwork. Here, high fives. And the Niners. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Bryson made that. And the 49ers. Thank you, Bryson. We love you. All right, just in time, we got everything unpacked. Now we're headed to the mustard drill with four minutes to spare. It was tight. <laughs> we're headed that way. Once again, welcome on board the Disney Wish and welcome to the Luna Lounge. My name is Shamim and I'm the assembly leader of Assembly Station H. Okay. Like we just walked up a lot of, a lot of stairs. <laughs> we are now on deck 11. Mustard drill is finished. Straight ahead is a toy story splash zone. Check it out. Oh, dude, that's one of Tucker's favorite shows. Little Pizza Planet, Rocket Ship, The Alien. Oh, this is really cool little pool. Excited to go down this bad boy? Yeah. Woo. The slightest source Rex. We got Woody over here, Buzz Lightyear, and Zorro. 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 
Zerch. Oh my gosh. Uh, I got Jesse, Bo Peep. Look at this, it's so cool. Celebrate party can't officially start until I have some of this. All right, Tuck and I are gonna throw down some pizza. Ready for this, Tuck? Cheers. Cheers. Think. Right? So good. So good. I think it's better than Pinocchio's just because I like Daisy better. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's the same recipe. But let's just go with Daisy's better. Are you ready for a new fun magical adventure? <laughs> I can't hear you. I said, are you ready for a new fun magical adventure? <laughs> But then well, we she, haven't had one in a long time. We haven't had one because due to the weather, the weather was perfect. So it might be just that, but it was on point. It was perfect. All right, we're gonna go back to our, our room to go on the veranda and watch us sell away that way. And then we're gonna get kind of ready for dinner and all that kind of stuff. So that's where we're hated. And the cool thing is we're just one deck below. Well, Lacey, how's your, uh, your cruise vacation thus far? Oh, 100%. Yeah, so nice. yeah, the vitamin D is extremely healthy. So, anyway, enjoy the time lapse. It's awesome. The crew is like whistling at us on this boat right here. Like they're just like waving. Hey! <laughs> Everybody, Lacey said that I couldn't wear a hat because it's gonna be our nice dinner. There's not really like an actual formal night, but we're at 1923 tonight, so it's kind of formal-ish. The other restaurants is Marvel and then Arendelle, and we're like, this is kind of the fancier of the, I guess, and whatever. Anyway, so we're all dressing up. <laughs> Tucker's like, Mom, why do we have to dress perfect? <laughs> That's his way of saying, why do we have to dress up? The reason why I got on here is because I'm not wearing a hat, but I want to show you where my hats are because of those hooks I was showing you. And by the way, we're watching Moana, it goes with the theme. But look, here's all my hats Thanks, with those little hooks that we'll link below. 
They're fantastic. And we have our like lanyards. You look side. nice. So that works. Thank you. Also, look at that sunset. Whew. Yep. 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 <laughs> There's just no words. Well, we made it to the Grand Hall. It's beautiful. Wow. The Walt side and there's a Roy side. So we're going to the Roy side. All right. Oh, look at this place. Wow. All the portholes. It's beautiful. I right, got that water going. Yep, yep, yep. H2O. The boys are already coloring, loving life. Okay, 1923, here is the menu. We have appetizers. This right here, this tortellini looks super good. So for the bread, it's fig and olive bread. And then it has honey butter. Sounds fantastic. Landon's already going to town. How is it, dude? Super good? I love all the art. Yeah, these are cool cases. Olaf. But that picture frame doesn't go there. It goes there. <laughs> I think it fell. And I love the uh, the leather booth as well. It's like super comfortable. It's like really it's really cozy over here. Is it good? <laughs> so this butter is fantastic. It's really good. Love everything about it. Probably the the like roller coaster area, like the Star Wars area. That's, that was their favorite thing in the uh, Oceaneers Lab was the roller coaster area. Right, you talk. Where do you want to go back to in the kids club? Uh, the, Star, the Star Wars. The Star Wars. My favorite thing is Tucker's bread. He just, Landon did it actually. Oh, Landon he, he, eats the, he eats the inside. <laughs> <laughs> Salt and pepper shakers, 1923. It's super cool looking. Okay, Landon got salad. He's Landon's a salad kind of guy. I love he it. Loves his lettuce. Love it. How how is it, dude? And Tucker loves his soup. And Tucker's all about that tomato soup. Here we all got the same, but it's a tortellini. It's got um, sun-dried tomatoes and it's got artichoke. I forget what like the sauce is on there, but it sounded really good. You guys ready for my dad joke? That was terrible. Goodness, that was amazing. The sun-dried tomatoes are so good. All right, everybody, cheers. Cheers for a great vacation. Cheers for a great vacation. And we got the Ro Napa romaine lettuce, which looks really good. There's a big hedge of lettuce. So here's a tomato soup, and look at that crouton. It's so big. Tucker said it was fantastic, so. Here we go. Oh my. And now for this this crouton. There's olives on the crouton. It's so good. So good. All right, boys, this dinner is here. They did the same thing. Cheese burgers. We got some fries and veggies. Yeah. <laughs> well, the peppered filet mignon has arrived. Looks like got some potatoes and bacon wrapped green beans. That looks amazing. And it has a little au jus sauce. Oh yeah. Filet mignon. Dip it into the, the peppercorn sauce. Here we go. Oh my gosh. Look at that. Definitely recommend this. That was amazing. Okay, dessert. I love this as Sweetly Ever After. That's cool. I'm gonna get the churro calientes and the ice cream sundae, because why not? Also, this menu is on point. I love everything about it. Oh, and then the back. Oh yeah, the, yeah, it's the, the binding. Yeah, it's a notebook. That's super cool. Put this in your purse, put this in your purse. In that movie. I think Cassie and I are both doing the same thing. But then we're also gonna share this. These are we're both like, I just wanna try a bite, and so. Oh, that looks good. It's always good to share, you know? This is the churro dessert, and this is my Sunday. I am a happy camper. Happy camper. That looks fantastic. The signature dessert tonight that Cassie and I got to split. And some kind of. Blueberry? Blueberry, Blueberry thing. thing, yeah. And lemon. Bar barbarian yeah. cream? Bar I think so. Barbarian cream? I think so. Yeah. These churros. And the coffee. Did we talk about we got coffee? Yeah, we got coffee too. It's just it's, uh, perfectly. It's so good, guys. Mm. 
10 out of 10. Dinner was, I mean, it was 100%. 10 out of 10, fantastic. The menu, everything about it was great. Grand Hall is happening tonight. Okay, the boys are going into the kids club. You guys ready? Yeah. Yeah? Oh, boys. oh yeah. Okay, it's really hard to see in here, but there's actually a night setting, okay, the for the lights. So, it ha so it's so like all cozy. dimmed. There's, like a, there's a night setting. But look, Steven is our room host and he's fantastic. Look at this. What is it? It's, it looks like, oh, it's like Minnie is Mouse. Is it a penguin? Oh, it's Minnie Mouse, obviously. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's Minnie Mouse. That's amazing. Good job, so, Steven. Look how this is with our I know. Oh my gosh, how does he do that stuff? That's super cool. Yeah, this whole night setting is unreal. So we got the bunk beds. On the bunk beds. And then we got Cass's bed. Yes. That's super this cool. Really oh, that's cool. There's a, a, a lamp and, a, and two USB ports yeah, over there. Perfect. That's awesome. And like a little shelf for your phone. That's super cool. They're going to Mickey's main cell. Yeah. See yeah. what they have. I've never had a Disney Cruise one. Disney Wish. This is just iconic. That one's pretty cool. I like that. I love it. And the price tag, if you guys are wondering. It's empty. It's empty, which means it's probably people. It's free. Dad joke. <laughs> All right, in the Walt Disney Theater, and I have to say the seats are so comfortable. I love how this theater has a balcony. It just makes it look so full and so open. Hey, what's up, boys? It was so fun. Was it? Yeah, like oh, me and Tucker went to the Star Wars area. Really? Like we pretend that we're going to Mars. And really? We, we start steer this, uh, the ship. Yeah? And like we uh, went to the Avengers area and like did our missions. We're here. Super excited for the show. Dinner, like, 10 out of 10. The menu was perfect. I was telling Lacey, I'm like, I ate every single thing on my plate. The appetizers were great. It was like, the So we're really excited for the show. What's the, sh what's the name called? Disney Sees the Adventure. Disney Sees the Adventure. Starting now. We'll see you after the show. Well, we just got out of the show. We'll talk about that in just a bit, but check this out. This is so cool. So we were just there, and there's the, uh, the Grand Hall. This is the bayou right here, really cool place. Kind of lounge, hang out, get a drink. There's Tiana the Frog right there. <laughs> right, that show was so good. The boys absolutely loved it. It's so funny because Tucker just got done watching Hercules before we went on the ship, and he watched it on the airplane too, and so there's a part where Hercules come out, came out, and he was sitting back in his chair, and then when Hercules came out, he just leaned forward and he was just like all into it. But Cassidy's doing a class, like a art class, drawing mini, I believe. And then Justin's at the room with the boys. They're getting their jammies on. They're watching a show. I'm gonna go fill up my water bottle and kind of explore a little bit, and then we're gonna switch. So that's what I'm up to. And it looks like Enchanted is on the Fennel Vision tonight. I love this movie. First time out on the deck at night, it is beautiful. And I cannot wait to ride that tomorrow. So fun. Well, it's boys night right now, hanging out, watching Bolt. This is quite nice, actually. Quite nice. Got my water filled up, so I'm trying to stay hydrated. And in the lobby atrium area, and there is Donald up there and Daisy right there. Justin's going to be so disappointed, but I'm sure we'll see her again. I found Cassidy. And don't worry about it. It takes a lot of time to do She's it. Trying. Quality over quantity. You want it to look great. Now on the top of the bill, we're going to draw a line that connects the two sides. Characters aren't easy to draw. They look easy because we make them look easy, but they're not. That's rope really cool. he does, like, on the top of that like, bill. Steps too. That's and a hat. Nice. So we're going to draw nice. a line. And the smears and the random lines everywhere. And again, if you were to draw the character perfectly, it's gonna take about an hour. All right, Cass, can I see your final All right, final She's product? somewhat done, but... That's so cool. Nice. She looks awesome. Thank and then, you. what notebook did you bring? Um, I just bought this one at Walmart so I could collect all these drawings. That was such a good yeah, idea. Because I always lose them or throw them away. Right. Sick, so. Yeah. It is really cool. Because we do these in like Disneyland too yeah, and Disney stuff. World, so now you can so. just like have your like collection. Yeah. yeah. And it'll just be like something to always look back on. Yeah. For I sure. love it.
Okay, the girls are back in the cabin. I almost fell asleep. They came back in and I was like, oh, okay. I got that second wind. So, I don't know. I don't know what we're gonna do. What are we gonna do, guys? I don't know. Might just be walking around, trying to get the lay of the land, because this ship is, it's a lot. It's really cool, really cool theming. It's just, the, whole, the layout's completely different than what I'm used to. I gotta take advantage of how empty the ship is right now and uh, do some exploring. So I stumbled into Dory's Forget-Me-Nots. Little fun story of just some things that you may have forgotten. But it's like a lot of like swim attire, stuff like that. And what brought me in was the mannequin and it had like a really cool like rash guard. Um, it's actually really cool. It's this Disney Cruise Line on the back. I might get it. I might get it. It's pretty cool, let me show you. Right here, Disney Cruise Line. It's a pretty cool rash guard. It's like 60 SPF, which is awesome. I know, it's pretty cool. The price tag is a little much, in my opinion. But it is pretty cool. Check out these cool sliders as well. <laughs> and I love this duffel bag. Disney Cruise Line, $29.99 with any purchase of $40 or more. That's super cool. I love this swimsuit right here. Look at this. And it's 40 bucks, which isn't bad. I just wish it said like Disney Cruise Line or something on it. All right, just made my way up to deck 11. Actually, I'm on deck 12 now. Look at that view though. And right here is the Aquamouse. Oh man, I can't wait to ride this tomorrow. That's gonna be awesome. It's crazy. Okay, I just stumbled upon the adults area. Everything is pretty much shut down. The Cove Bar. Oh my gosh, this is beautiful out here. I'm definitely coming back tomorrow. Cove Cafe is over here as well. All these different pools. These lounge chairs are super cozy. Goodness. Okay, so this is technically deck 12 where the Cove Cafe is and all the adult stuff. So I'm gonna come back here tomorrow for some coffee and a little bit of adult time in the pools. Pretty cool. Looks like a movie is starting on Funnel Vision. Beautiful night for that. It's like perfect out here. I wonder what it is. Looks like it's Mary Poppins. Super cool. Okay, I'm going to get some pizza. <laughs> I'm already hungry. I think there's a game show happening right now. I'm gonna go check that out for a little bit. So many new things to see. It's almost hard to process. Oh wait, I passed the pizza. Actually, I didn't pass the pizza. See what I mean? There's a lot to explore. A lot to remember where things are at. So this will help me just walk around. Oh yeah, Daisy's Pizza Pie is hopping tonight. Okay, so I found out what the game show is. It's Match Your Mate which is hilarious because I'll be going by myself. Because Lacey, she just she just messaged me. She's like, can you uh, just kind of close out the vlog? I'm going to bed. So I guess I'm going to match your mate by myself. But before I do that, it's already started. No rush. We're gonna throw down some pizza. I got pepperoni, cheese, so good. So Daisy's Pizza is open till, I think it was midnight. I have to come back around and get some more. So this ship is definitely different. It's hard to like compare it to the other ships because it's just so different. One thing I am going to compare is the food. The dining experience tonight was just so good. It really was. And, and not to min not just that, but also Marceline's Market. So the lunch options, like when we, if I'm kind of, if I'm comparing like going to Cabana's on the first day of the cruise, sitting down and having a buffet versus Marceline's Market, Marceline's Market, 10 out of 10. Like the options that they had, uh, the variety they had, it was just fantastic. Uh, the setup, the, the way it was laid out, obviously, was different. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna compare that, but just the food, way better. I'm gonna finish this pizza and head down to match your mate. All right, we are on deck four, headed to Luna, the Wonderland Cinema. I can't wait to check this out. All right, here's Luna. Match your mate just started. Let's check it out. Will you just tell us uh, where you went for your first date? Went to the shopping center, shopping mall. Remember the name of it? Uh, very nice.
match we made was awesome. It's pretty fun because when Lacey and I were first married on our honeymoon, we did match we made. It was like the first game show we ever did. And uh, ever since then, we tried to go to one on a ship, so I'm glad I was able to make it. Wow, that was such a fun day. Tonight was helpful, just kind of walking around. I was looking at the diagram of the ship and just kind of see where everything was at. But it was a full day. It is 11.45. I'm exhausted. I uh, got another slice of pizza just for the road and head back to the stateroom. Uh, it's so good. We're really excited for tomorrow. We're, we're, we're very excited for, for breakfast tomorrow at Marceline's Market because their, their buffet is fantastic. So it's going to be great. I think we have Marble, the Marble restaurant tomorrow. Port of Call is NASA, but we're actually staying on the ship. We're like, man, we've been to NASA before. We just want to explore the ship as much as possible. So uh, we're going to stay on the ship, uh, probably do the pool, explore some other areas of the ship that we haven't explored yet. And it's going to be a good time, guarantee it. Anyways. Love you guys. Thank you so much for watching until the end. If you did watch till the end, maybe put a little cruise ship emoji in the comments below. We appreciate you guys watching till the end. We love you all. If you have not subscribed, consider doing that. We have a lot of Disney content to come. We have the rest of the Disney Wish. Castaway Key is going to be happening in a couple days, which I'm so excited for. But also we're going to the Beach Club and we're staying in Walt Disney World for like six days. So it's going to be a lot of Disney content, so stay tuned for all that. So again, subscribe if you haven't subscribed, like this video so it reaches other people, and also ring the bell so you're notified when more videos come. Lisa and I were talking before she went to bed, and she's like, oh, I'm so excited for, for room service tomorrow morning, and so hopefully we'll have some coffee on the veranda, and it's just gonna be a good time. But anyways, I better get some sleep. Tomorrow's gonna come very soon, but we'll see you in the next one. Love you guys.